What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Survival. In the last episode, I made the automatic chicken farm, which I have been doing a lot of work on since last episode. Well, mainly today, I've been doing a lot of work on trying to get that thing working. And what I've also done today is uh, I've gone looking for horses, and as you can see, I found myself a few horses so this episode I'm gonna see if I can actually find a horse that is decently fast and um, we are now gonna have a a nice source of transportation if this guy would you know just love me come on come on okay I see you how you doing buddy no come on one more time here we go right here this time this time I got it right here oh. No, okay, okay, all right. Uh huh. There we go. Oh, I'm gonna say this guy jumps high. Hm. Uh. What a horse, man! This thing is fast. All right. Well, if it doesn't, if it doesn't uh run too fast, see in the floor. Right, let's take a look here. I'm gonna go ahead and say he jumps using the floor. I'm gonna say he jumps four blocks. No. No, three and a half then. Well, this guy is extremely crappy. Um, I never really went back here to see if there was anything. I did kill a bunch. Oh man, I did kill a bunch of cows on my way over here last time. This is my second trip coming over here. Um, but I'm checking to see if there's anything going on back here. Oh, looks like he's speeding up a little bit. Not really, though. Still pretty damn slow. I haven't been back over here before. Oh, there is more. Yes. All right. Yeah, these guys look nice, actually. But this guy, unfortunately, isn't doing it. So let's see if these guys... This guy looks really nice. This horse doesn't have any health at all, though. He's got, what? Eight hearts? Yeah, this guy's definitely gonna need the diamond armor. <laughs> come on, buddy. And it's more up there on that hill. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's get it. Come on. There we go. Alright. No. Is that an all black horse over there? Shit. Yeah, this guy looks like he probably jumps like three blocks. Man. Yeah, I'm gonna say he jumps three. Alright, well. This guy isn't too fast, unfortunately. How's his brother doing? I'm gonna have to sleep here in a second, because it's getting dark. Come on. This guy looks nice, too. Nice color, nice color. He has eight hearts as well. I'm gonna... Say he's probably really slow as well. There's more horses down there. It seems like brown ones over there. Come on. I need that in that. Let's go. Come on. This one. Right here. This one. Oh. No. You don't like me? There we go. How's this guy doing? Seems maybe a little bit faster than that guy over there. Oh, for some reason, I thought those chickens had something on their heads. <laughs> oh, this guy isn't a jumper at all. Jesus, man. This guy jumps like a block. I'm gonna say that's maybe two and a half block jump. Alright, this guy's pretty damn slow. Let me sleep real fast before anything spawns in here. Yep. Alright. How you doing, chicken? Looking at me sleep. Alright. Let's go see... How fast is Black Horse is up here? Okay, come on. Okay. Oh, there we go. That's a decent amount of health. 12. Hearts isn't bad. I'm gonna say this guy might be pretty fast. If it is, I'm keeping this guy, because this guy looks pretty badass. Alright, here we go. Don't be slow. Ah! Not too bad. 
Oh, nice. We got some donkeys down there. Not bad, actually. These are the coordinates, if you're wondering. Um, if you're playing on this seed. Not bad at all. Let's go over here and test this jump. This force isn't that bad. Oh, I guess it's not a high jumper at all. Yeah, this guy jumps like two blocks. <laughs> Alright, well, he's not a jumper. Alright, well, we'll keep this guy in consideration. I'm just gonna take my stuff off him for now. He does look really cool, though. That's nice. Let's, get, let's try to get another one with his mouth open. Come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, get it! Stop looking at me, bitch. Hey, go. Don't look at me. Come on. Come on. Perfect screenshot. Just open your mouth up. Okay, well, that'll work. Alright, let's go ahead and see... How fast this horse is. This guy looks nice as well. He has 10 hearts. Not bad. Oh. Alright, alright. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. You don't like me? Yeah, he's thinking about it. Come on. <sighs> this is the worst part about them these damn horses. Let's go! Probably should have brought maybe some wheat. There we go. Alright, this guy. This guy's pretty fast. This is jump crap. It kind of seems like it is. Can you at least jump three blocks? Oh shit. He can. Alright, this horse isn't bad at all, actually. Not bad, not bad. Um, I might come back here at a later time and get one of those donkeys. Because that would be nice. Donkey, a mule. Yeah, it's a donkey. Yeah, I might come back and get one of these guys down here. Look how cute they are. Alright, but I think for now this horse is pretty good. Is there any more over here? I think that's pretty much all of them. This horse is nice, though. Alright. Uh-huh. There's more down there. It seems like, yeah. There's a few over there. Some right over here. Yeah, there's a bunch, actually. I guess I just had to... Go far enough out. Alright, well, this horse is fine. For now, one other thing I would like to go do is... Enchant this axe with maybe like a level 26 or something like that. Let's see what I can get. Oh, wow. I didn't even see these guys. Look how nice these horses look. The all white ones and some that have the black on the top. A little bit of gray. That's, that looks nice as well. All right. So let's get out of here. This horse has a nice, nice amount of horsepower, if you know what I'm saying. So... We'll stick with this guy for now. But um, I'm going to head back to the house. And another thing I was looking at right before I started the episode was the statistics. I actually like looking at this stuff. And look at that. Distance by horse. 2.68 kilometers. And for some reason I thought distance flown. I don't remember ever flying on this world. And I was thinking it was probably... Distance, um, distances like jump, jumping like the time from your takeoff and the time you hit the floor. But apparently it's not that, but I do not ever remember going into creative on this world, so I don't know what that's about. But, um, it's cool to look at the statistics. And as you can see, I have to scratch my leg. The breeding, animals bred, 120. I've been breeding the crap out of the animals I have over there. Mainly the cows chickens and pigs and it's nice to see the deaths I had on this um minutes played 1.2 1.12 days which is cool distance swum distance fallen distance climbed 
It's cool to look at this stuff, actually. Jumps. <laughs> 36,000. <000. laughs> Damage dealt. Number of death. That's not bad. I want to see if I can keep my deaths to a minimal on this world. But who knows how long that's going to last. But this honestly isn't too far away from my house. Of course. Of course that always happens. I mean, I don't, you know, that's always a common occurrence. And look at that. Haul on ass up that hill. Alright, but I will cut back in once I'm near the house and I'll show you how the chicken farm's going and everything else. I might actually make a barn sometime soon. And uh, possibly maybe get rid of what I built on episode episode 10. Right? I think episode 10. Because I think this is 12. The episode where I built the animal thing. I might a little animal pen Design, I might make that into a barn and have all the animals in there. And have a few spaces for, you know, some horses and maybe a donkey. But as a matter of fact, I believe we are almost back at the house. So, that honestly isn't a point in cutting out. Because I'm pretty sure right over this hill... Yep, yeah, right over this hill we'll be back to the house. Because there's, there's a swamp like right next to where I'm staying right now. And we're going up this way. There we go. There you go. You can see everything. Alright, so for now... Yeah, cuz... Oh, no. Don't really... Care for this design too much. I don't know. I gotta see what I want to do, but for now... I bet you can hear there's only 20,000 cows. I'm gonna put the horse right there. But this is the chicken farm. It's been working a little bit. Don't know why there's raw chicken in there. <laughs> but... As you can see, up here we got about, I think like 80 chickens, 75 chickens. Let's take a look. I would say about 80. There's a bunch in here. <laughs> I did all of that today, and it's working a little bit. There's a few guys over here, a few little chickens. As you can see, there's a bunch of cows right over here. There's about... 30 here. We got some chickens over in this area. As you can see. Some piggies right over here. And haven't done too much breeding with the sheep. There's only like, yeah, there's only four sheep in there, so. Haven't done much with those guys. But over here, hopefully soon, this thing should be working a little bit faster. I do have some chickens in this hole right over here. Producing some eggs. Going into a hopper. But, um... Yep, still haven't done anything in here. <laughs> I should probably do something over here soon. But I think for now, what I would like to do is... Go explore that strip mine real fast. Uh, okay, I got a bunch of ladders. Not ladders. Fences right here, so I'm gonna place the horse... Right over there. Put that there. Okay. So. What I would like to do now. I chopped down a bunch of oak and spruce wood. I just made one of those giant spruce trees. And it works pretty well. That method. I want to make some torches real fast. Because I don't know how big. Of a cave that is. I'm going to start working on the. The house probably, probably soon. I just got to uh, see what else is going on. That haven't really done much as you can see, but hopefully soon I can do a lot more. So, all right, just you know, try to come down here at a nice rate. All right, let's go see if there's anything going on in this cave over here. I don't even know if this goes anywhere, to be honest. I do hear some zombies, which is nice. Hello? What's up, guys? Oh, we got a creepy as well. Oh. I do not ever remember being over here, so... This is just connected to another cave, which it actually might be. No torches in here, so 
Not entirely sure what the hell's going on in here. Don't ever remember being in here. So. Whatever, I guess we'll just light this up for now. See if I can gain a few more levels. Oh, here we go. Be n really nice if I could find a skeleton spawner. Okay, what is this? I think... Yeah, I think I've been over here, actually. Oh, I got a potato. Right in the lava. Um... Hmm. I think I was over here when I was looking for emeralds. I think that's when I came over here. Hey, buddy. Fucker. Okay. Another... Another few skeletons, and they creepy. And oh, you're dead. This goes... Over to another area. Oh, there might have been a chicken jockey. Whatever they're called. Down here, as if it's a random chicken. There's probably a chicken jockey, and the jockey died. There's another one. Yeah, I've been over here before. I thought so. Oh, hey, buddy. It's the second one with gold armor we've seen today. Um. Yeah, I think I've gotten pretty much everything out of here that I need. There's a dead end. Unfortunately, I do not have a lot of arrows. So that's why I would like to find a spawner. So I can actually get some arrows. And I hear a bunch of zombies. Kind of over here. Hello? Here we go. Oh, fucker. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, son of a bitch. <whistles> All right, then. <laughs> and this is just the statistics. I'll be dead soon. <laughs> um. Well, then. I do not know how I just lived that, but all right. I'm not going to complain about that. I'm just kind of regenning some of my health. I'm going to head back over there now. All right, well. I was kind of expecting to die there. I don't know how I didn't. Let's get this gunpowder. All right. Got to make, actually, one of those golden apples sometime soon. All right. Did I just piss him off? Let me just take out the skeleton first. Two skeletons. No problem. So, big ass ravine over here. Let me see if I can kill this fucker. There we go. Uh, it doesn't look like there's much in here. Let me collect this gold. Look at that gold. Alright. Alright, is there anything up here? Let's take a look. This way, look, 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 no. So I almost came up here and died for no reason. But it's all good. Alright, so yeah, I think there's not much else in this cave. I'm pretty sure. So, I guess we're going to get out of here. I didn't realize that this cave connected to the... To that other cave. I gotta make some... Boots with feather falling soon, or at least I got to attempt to get feather falling on them. Alright, this, this is going anywhere. I don't even know what the exit is, where the exit is. Uh, I think that's a dead end up there. Alright, so let's get out of here now. Alright. Well, at least we found a fairly decent horse um thanks for pretty much set on a horse now i'm gonna go back probably off screen and get one of those donkeys all right just straight back and make a left and we'll get out of this place all right anything over here 
Don't know. I'm not going to bother to check. Alright, so... I guess that's probably going to wrap up this episode. Yeah. Um, next episode, I'm probably going to start working on the house. Yeah, I got to... Uh, let's make a few things. Let me see. Oh, it's going to go straight down. Great. Oh, back to the bottom. Nice. I'm glad I threw that straight up and not on an angle. Fantastic, man. Nice job. All right, but... Oh! I'm going to check this guy first. Can I see what I can get? Leave me some... Some, uh... Some guesses on what you think I'm going to get on this thing with a level 26. I'm going to try to get... The enchantment table to output a level 26. And see what I can get. Bye bye. That guy's done. Yep. <laughs> Any witches up here? Oh, a few creepies. Some zombies. Alright. I should. I actually should go on the new update and, and uh, see how that stuff works. So, actually, I'm going to cut out and go on the new snapshot just to see what I can get. So I will be back in just a second. All right, guys. Oh, what the hell? I'm back on the new snapshot. And my crosshair. It's kind of weird. I don't know what that's for, but uh, okay. As you can see, 14W04B. And I believe you need lapis for something, I think. Let me, uh, let me go take a look over here on how this works. I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. Efficiency 3, efficiency 2, unbreaking 1. So what does this do? Okay. 22 is the highest. So if I break one of these, it is 28. Oh, we are almost 28, so... Is there any creepers up here that I can kill? Uh, let's say despawn. They might have despawned. Oh, I hear a little zombie somewhere. He will definitely give me those two and a half bars that I need. Where the hell is he? Oh, he's probably in here. Hello? Little shitter. Sounds like he's from over here. Where is he? Oh, shit, there he is. Oh, seems like there's a little water source in there. That didn't get me to level 28. Close, though. Uh, piggy. Let's see if he'll get me there. I think he should. Do, do. Are you kidding me? Spider! Hey! How you doing? So, how'd you like getting people to level 28? Eh, yeah, thank you. Alright, let me... That. Oh shit. Whoo! That's right, creeper. What you want? Okay. Let's head back over here. Enchant this. I need to make a new helmet soon. Alrighty, here we go. So that goes in there. Fortune 2. I actually like this a lot. Fortune 2. Is it the same thing each time or what? Uh-huh. Interesting. So, Fortune 2. Fortune 2. Yeah, this looks like the same exact one lettering each time. Do I have to do this? What the fuck? Interesting, interesting. So, I'm not really looking for a pick just with Fortune 2 on it. That's great, that's great. Um, hmm. Well, I placed that other torch down. Let me... Let's see what this does if I don't place it on the wall. Fortune 2 again. Take one of these. What does this give me? 26. I don't want Fortune 2! Screw it. 
Great. Great. Just what I'm looking for. Just what I'm looking for. <sighs> I'm looking for a shovel or a uh, axe that's going to break in two seconds. That is, uh... Three levels, really? All right, let's uh go ahead, <laughs> and we're making another one. Do not know what that bullshit was about, but I'm making another axe because this thing's gonna break in two seconds. I'm glad I picked that up. Take this, put that there. Take this, put that one right there. Level twenty-two, efficiency three. What the? What is this? I don't understand how this works at all. Efficiency 3. Alright, so... I don't understand why it's taking, like, a level. So I can, uh... <clears throat> Enchant this shovel with a uh, level 23. So does it take less levels or what? My question. Uh huh. So let's let's take a look here. I'm gonna make. should I make here? I know that I have two shitty axes. Which is just fantastic. I guess I'm using this one. Um, what if I make... You guys are probably going to call me an idiot, but what if I make another one? For example. Would it be possible for me to get unbreaking at all? That's unbreaking two. Uh, I'm breaking two efficiency three with level 15, but it's only going to take two levels. Is that how that works? So you need a, a minimum requirement of, of the, uh, so for me, I, I guess to use 23 or the third one, I'd have to have 23 levels. So this is, um, this I'm breaking two. So that gives me I'm breaking two. All right. I kind of understand it. Um, Kind of weird, but all right. That only costs three levels. Okay, well, what I'm going to do first is use this whole shovel and then add the unbreaking to it. Or not the shovel. The axe. Because it would be pretty pointless for me to combine these two and waste... Pretty much waste an axe, so all right. That works, I guess. Kind of weird. But, um... I don't know. Different, I guess. So, that's gonna do it for today's episode. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys next time.